good to be here back at Stanford. We're kind of remembering. The 50s were very quiet here. We did a lot of studying. We also <laughs> partied and we studied. That was about it. But as far as civic action, not so much. But then in the spring of 1960, we did. There were sit-ins at the Woolworth stores in the South because they were they were refusing to seat black people at their lunch counters. So a group of us organized by the religious groups went to Woolworths in Palo Alto and there we had informational picketing. We had flyers urging people not to patronize at Woolworths and educating folks about sit-ins. That was the beginning of sit-ins. So and it was beginning of the 60s and all of the protests that we were involved with after that. You know, I don't remember anyone trying to stop us. I remember some heated conversations with people saying, well, what does this have to do with us? And a feeling that we weren't changing very many minds. But that was just the beginning. Right. And all consciousness raising starts here and goes up, right? Uh -huh. So, although there weren't confrontations, we, looking back, I see that we were getting an important idea there, like a seed, and we were helping it grow.